Welcome to 2K Sports. We're ready to brighten the weekend with some Saturday night basketball. This is Brian Anderson with Hall of Famers Grant Hill and Doris Burke. Allie LaForce, our reporter. It's the Los Angeles Clippers and the Sacramento Kings. So here's the Clippers starting group. Chris Paul out there with George. Then there's Kawhi Leonard. And it's Brand in at the four. Pass to Leonard. Just five on the clock. That three's off the mark. Well, the defense clearly was not interested in guarding him from downtown. They're very fortunate he missed. Here's Weber. Ooh, and he took a hard foul on the shot. So he'll head to the line to shoot a pair. Yeah, and you never want to let shots at the rim go uncontested. Sacramento shooting their first free throws of this game. First free throw is good. And he makes both free throws. Boy, a really soft touch on display. It is a luxury to have a big man who can hit from the line at a consistent rate. Pass to Brand. Here's McAdoo. And here's Leonard. Five on the clock. And a big bounce off the rim, but it sinks right in. Boy, laser focus from Kawhi Leonard. He no sooner touches it than that ball is off to the rim. And just over a minute played here to start the game. Here's Richmond, George defending. Well, not only is he a tremendous athlete, but Paul George is a terrific positional defender. He just uses that body so well to contest shots. Leonard with the ball. Stoyakovich grabs the board. Boy, surprised he missed that. The defense just good enough to prevent that bucket. Pass to Weber. Shot clock at five. It's rebounded by George. Now Los Angeles with it. Here's Brand. He tries for three. Doesn't go. And he's 0 for 1 from the floor. Pass to Richmond. Shoots over George. And that one off the back of the rim and in. This guy is a pick-your-poison kind of player. Very hard defensively to cover all your bases with him. Here's Brand. Now here's George. Goes to the reverse layup and drops it in. We are talking about a proficient, efficient scorer in Paul George. Go to work, sir. And the Kings call time here. <laughs> With the offense reeling, coach has to get these guys on the same page. And to me, they're just taking too many tough shots. And when they do get an easy one, the confidence just isn't there.
So it's Sacramento now. Here's Weber. That one drops for him. And setting the tempo with an assertive move, like, where was the defense on that play? To me, that's a complete lack of communication on that side of the ball. These guys need to be talking to each other. Now here's Paul. Pass to Brand. Down to five on the shot clock. And the basket by Leonard. This is a small forward who, because he's 230 pounds, can hold his own down in the low post. That is nicely done. Here's Robertson. He's guarded by Paul. Here's Robertson. Yet to see a basket. Can't hit from in close. Great rim protection to prevent him from converting. Beautiful. George. And he'll draw the foul. He'll head to the line for two. You cannot give Paul George these extra chances. This guy is deadly from the free throw line throughout his career. Los Angeles shooting their first free throws here for the night. Take a break. Take a break. Two shots. He misses the free throw. And that one drops. So now they lead by one. On offense, here are the Kings. Pass to Richmond, down low. And down it goes! Jam that one home! Sometimes a player is born with a passer's mindset. He deals it with conviction. Here's Brand. And here's Leonard. Fires from deep. Nails it from beyond the arc. Leonard's got seven points in the game. And he's a selective three-point shooter. Kawhi only takes them if he feels he has a good look. Pass to Weber. Here's Richmond. George defending. The shot by Richmond. No good. <laughs> and I'm surprised that didn't go down. I mean, I'm sure he is too. It's George on the wing. Here's Paul. Fires the three. Oh, and another three for the Clippers. Well, Chris Paul, by nature, wants to pass the ball, but if you leave him open, he understands he's got to make those shots. To the inside, here's Richmond. Doesn't go that time. And George with some nice D. Here's McAdoo. No made baskets yet. Here's Brand. It's hauled in by Lucas. Boy, they'd love if anyone could get a bucket. Yeah, their offense has been grinding to a halt. Richmond with the bucket. Pounding it inside early and often, setting a physical tone. Hit me, I'm open. Now Paul to the wing, right side. Brand. Off target from three-point range. Here's Robertson. George defending. And out of bounds. Los Angeles will have it. The Clippers making a switch here. The Clippers lead by three. Here's Free. Pass to Leonard. And so he draws the foul, headed to the line to shoot a pair. You can see the kind of savvy Kawhi Leonard plays with. This guy makes the defense commit and gets himself to the foul line. Los Angeles shooting their third and fourth free throw attempts of the game. Take a break. Take a break. Two shots. And the first one at the line is good. 
Kawhi is known as a low-key guy, but don't let that fool you. He's as competitively tough as they come. And Leonard drops them both. An efficient night from the line. This is a guy who puts in the work and it pays dividends. Timeout called. The Kings. Kings trail by five. Here's Archibald. Pass to Richmond from 12 feet. It's hauled in by Brand. And so it's Leonard with it. He'll bring it up for the LA Clippers. Now here's Paul. Back to Leonard. And all around the rim that time before dropping. Leonard's got 11. Uh, the vision and the understanding of Chris Paul is something to behold. Archibald, pass to Richmond. Here's Embry. Boom! He jams it straight down. Well, what he lacks in size for a typical center, he makes up for with all that athleticism. Boy, can he elevate. Pass to Leonard. With some arc. That one is off. The Kings trailing. Here's Richmond. Here's Robertson. Here's the pick. Uneasy two on the layup. When they get their opportunity to punch it inside, they don't hesitate. Los Angeles leading by three. Leonard outside. Back to Paul. Drives to the hoop. And the foul on the shot. So he'll take two from the free throw line. Well, a tremendous call by Chris Paul. Refuses to back off, doesn't waste the look, and gets a foul for his work. Los Angeles shooting their fifth and sixth free throws of the game. Take a break. Take a break. Two shots. And he drops the first. If you're a head coach, you love having a guy like Chris Paul around. He's a coach on the floor for you and helps keep everyone accountable. And Sacramento making a change here. Cousins is checked in. Both good from the line that time. Kings trail by five. Here's Archibald. Hasn't gotten one to fall yet. Pass to Embry. Inside. 
Here's Robertson. Oh, and makes it with the kiss. There's real synergy in play right now on the offensive end. The pass was right where it needed to be. Paul taking his time here. Here's Brand. He shoots a three. And it's good. First made shot in four attempts. Three points. Brand's gone one for three from beyond the arc. Here's Richmond. Going inside. It's hauled in by Brand. He's got a great defensive mind. He gets good position and affects the release. And he did it without fouling, and that's become an art, changing shots without making contact. Here's McAdoo. Pass to Manning. Knocked loose. Cousins with the steal. And they're pushing it up. And Robertson gets it to go. Robertson's got six. He was way ahead of the pack. No one around to contest. He can do anything he wants in that situation. Big time play right there, showing the activity and ability to impact this game. Here's Manning. No points so far. Clock at six. Here's Paul. And there's the rejection. DeMarcus Cousins proving you don't have to be a high flyer to block shots. That's about positioning and timing. That's been the story of their offense so far. Getting a number of looks from point-blank range. Timeout called. The Clippers. Substituting on the court. And it's Paul with the ball for Los Angeles. Jordan, the screen. Pass to Leonard. To Paul. Here's free. Still no points. Look at the power on that. He has to be one of the top dunkers in the game today. Here's Archibald to the middle. Here's Embry. And down it goes. Dunked it through off a beautiful setup. Well, hit a man in stride. That is a textbook delivery. Outside Paul. Has to free. Just five to shoot. And again, it's the Clippers converting. And this night already has the makings of an offensive war. Well, the fans love it. Coaches may not like the lack of defense, but boy, the rules promote scoring, no doubt. Drains the triple. Richmond's got nine points. Don't want to let him get into a rhythm from out there. And he lobs it up top. Boy, left it right in the sweet spot with the lob. Nicely done. 
But Kawhi Leonard right now is cooking, folks. This guy has got a rhythm, and you better watch out. 103 left in the opening quarter. Here's Embry. Second chance effort. He's off on the layup, and the ball out of play. The Kings will have it. So it's both teams making substitutions here. Kings trail by three. Pass to Archibald. There's 45 seconds left in the first. Here's Lucas. And the fans love seeing incredible moments on defense like that block. Oh my, oh my. And that was textbook defense. Positioning himself well to send it back. Forty seconds left to play in the first quarter. Here's Lucas. No points yet. Five to shoot. Late clock here. The Kings need to get one up. Fires from the line. And he connects with a jumper. Well, you love it. DeMarcus Cousins drawing the defensive attention and still has the court awareness to make the play. Leonard against Johnson. Now here's Leonard. He's guarded closely. Jacks up a three. The shot misses. And at the end of one, a closely contested game so far. The Clippers on top, up by one. Let's take a quick break, and then it's on to the second quarter after this. And it's been a pretty even game here after one quarter of play. And a moment now to quickly take a look at the offensive approach for the Clippers. Well, we're in the era of the three-point basket. So if you want to win games in this league, you have to connect from deep. And they have been thus far. We've also seen them show a willingness to take advantage of the mid-range opportunities. The defense conceding these looks, and they're cashing in. They've got Johnson, and it's Lucas in at the power forward position. That's the five to begin the second quarter for the Kings. Bibby, the pass to Johnson. Here's Archibald, five on the clock. Pass to Lucas. There's the three. And it's Jordan with the rebound. The Clippers in the lead. Here's Leonard. Nice balance from Kawhi Leonard there. Once Kawhi Leonard gets to the interior, this guy's so tough to keep from scoring. Here's Archibald. Cousins with the screen to the paint. And Cousins throws it down. This really puts the defense in a bind. Cousins on the roll is absolutely brutal. Pass to Jordan. Just over a minute gone here in the second quarter. Here's Leonard. And Leonard powers it down. That pass had to be thrown not only in the right spot, but at the right time. Cousins with it. Over Jordan. That one's wide left. Here's Free. Here he goes. To the inside. And slam dunk by Jordan. Well, that's about as high percentage as it gets for DJ. Go to work, big man. Here's Archibald. Outside Johnson. Inside. Here's Cousins. It's rebounded by Los Angeles. Leonard outside. Pass to free. 
Back to Leonard. Leonard, double team. Here's free. The shot. And there's another one for the Clippers. Quarter two and just under two and a half minutes gone by. Archibald, the pass to Bibby. Archibald, good. Archibald's gotten his second bucket. This is what we call highly efficient play. Working off the screen, getting to the cup. Here's Harper, still without a bucket. Leonard on the wing, covered by Johnson. Leonard outside. The Clippers got a hurry. Late clock here. And Harper gets it to go. Harper's gotten himself on the board with a three there. That is such a tough matchup for smaller timeout, defenders timeout. out there. He can simply shoot right over them. Timeout called. Sacramento. Here's Richmond, Leonard defending. Just under three and a half minutes played here in the second quarter. Pass to Lucas. Let's go with a three. Hits the three-pointer. Lucas has gotten himself going here. His first point of the game on the deep ball. Leonard outside. And he's going to the line for two. The official saw contact while he was going up. Because Kawhi Leonard has such a well-rounded offensive game, it's easy for him to put the defense in a bad position. Draws contact there. Take a break. Take a break. Two shots. Free throw drops for Leonard. Harper, he's checked in for the Clippers. And Leonard drops them both. And here in the second quarter of action, as we approach four minutes played. Pass to Stoyakovic. Knocks it loose. And stolen by Leonard. And it's the Clippers on the break. Two shots, two makes. Off to a good start. This is intelligent basketball. 
forcing a turnover and then immediately starting the fast break. Out left to the wing. Here's Stoyakovic from outside the arc. Leonard pulls down the board. He didn't make them pay for that weak defense, but they just can't rely on him to miss those kind of shots. Here's Harper. And he was fouled while in the act of shooting, so he'll take two free throws. Good on that one. He hits the second from the line. So it's Sacramento now. It's a 10-point game. Bibby, the pass to Sabonis. To the right side. Here's Stoyakovich. And another miss by Sacramento. And it's Paul with the ball for Los Angeles. 10-point lead. This is their biggest of the game. A quick shot there. It's off target. That's his shot. And one, I'm sure, he wants back. Here's Sabonis, uses the glass to finish the layup. Now Sabonis able to finish on the interior, that's pretty. Leonard outside. Pass to Kamen. And here's George. He's in his comfort zone, two for two to start this one. The defense must push Paul George further out. This guy's so adept at finding ways to score inside. Picked by Sabonis. Here's Bibby. He drops it from range. Bibby's got his first bucket of the game, and he's on the board for three. Defensively, you can't afford to get stuck on the pick. You know exactly what that takes. It takes energy. It takes activity. It takes intensity. And the basket is good. And Los Angeles leads by nine. Well, they're trying to establish their attack down in the paint. And make no mistake, these help their overall confidence. Pass to Stoyakovich. Three-pointer, no good. And so here are the Clippers. Harper passes to Kamen. Got a hand on it. Here's Richmond. He's got nine. 16 feet out. Again, the king score. This guy plays with such confidence and ability to score in a variety of ways. Nice. Pass to Kamen. Leonard for three. Rebound by Sacramento. Here's Bibby. Down low. Here's Sabonis. And he can't bank that one in. Well, this is how you shut him down. A tremendous contest against a very skilled player. Kings trail by seven. Pass to Lucas. 4-3. Drills it from deep. Lucas has got six here in the quarter. This is as pure a shooter as there is. You've got to stay connected or it's a problem. Now here's Leonard. The three. It's rebounded by Sabonis. No idea why he's attempting so many outside shots. It's not his day, and he needs to either look to drive or get it to an open teammate. Pass to Bibby. Here's Stoyakovic. He's scoreless. George outside. Double team on Leonard. Here's Paul. It's good. And the assist that time from Leonard. And Los Angeles leads by six. Well, that's about Chris Paul getting to his spot and making the defense pay. This guy is lethal with his mid-range game. 
Here's Bibby. Pass to Richmond. Here's Stoyakovic. Leonard defending. Just four to shoot. So bonus. The pass to Richmond. Nails it from three. Richmond's got 14 points. And that's on the defense, giving him a decent look. Time that's out, time his out. shot. Time called here. Los Angeles decides Sorry. to talk it over. So both teams changing it up here. George outside. Leonard outside. Six on the shot clock. Shoots. The shot won't fall. Kings trail by three. Pass to Robertson. Oh, and the fast break for the Clippers. Came and passes to Leonard. It's stolen away. That one's good by Stoyakovich. Stoyakovich has got his first bucket in this one. Now here's Paul. Defense is right there. George finds Leonard. They set the pick. Six to shoot. And there's a whistle. He'll head to the line to shoot two. Man, the defender really went after him. The free throw drops for Leonard. And Leonard drops them both. Here's Robertson. He's got six. Pass to Lucas. Here's Richmond. George defending. They get the rebound. Weber passes to Lucas. Basket counts. Lucas has got eight points here in the quarter. Sees his man has the angle on the interior and drops a dime right there. Leonard outside. Fires the three. It's good. The assist that time from Paul. Paul's got five assists in the game. Boy, major defensive laps on that trip, leaving him all alone in three-point territory, and he drills it. Here's Richmond. 14 points for him. Here's Stoyakovich. Tried to come right back with a three of his own, but it's no good. Here's George. The rebound by Robertson. Kings trail by four. With the drive, here's Lucas. Banked it in off the glass. Lucas has got ten. How about the timing? Can be the difference between an assist and a turnover. Nice delivery. Outside Paul. Pass to Leonard. The fader. And he didn't get quite enough under that one. I'm sure he's kicking himself. He hates to blow that kind of opportunity. Here's Richmond. Here's Weber. And he makes no mistake. Slam dunk. <laughs> and when the game is this close, you have to go all out. He certainly understands his role, huh? When the shot goes up, just crashes the offensive glass. And that's so demoralizing to your opponent. To play great defense and have the possession end that way, that's tough to take. And that one falls. That puts him up one point in the game now. 
1-10 left in the second period. Pass to Brand. Back to Paul. And the layup is good after a nice lead pass. Paul's gotten four this quarter. Yeah, Chris Paul opportunistic on the inside in that instance. Here's Weber. Fades back. And yes, it goes. Got a little English on that one. He's got 11. Oh, another lead change. Six total in the first half. And this is the battle we were hoping to see. George outside. Here's Brand. Yes, and it's George picking up the assist. And Los Angeles leads by two. Love the way Paul George shares the rock. Sometimes I think doesn't get enough credit for his ability as a distributor. Here's Lucas. Ten points for him. Out to the right wing. Down to five on the shot clock. Beyond the arc. Hits the trifecta. Richmond's got 17. <laughs> That's how you up the ante. Come right back at him. And you would expect nothing less from these two. Taking pride and making plays. Leonard for three. The shot off that time. And the first half comes to a conclusion in a game that's been very close so far. Sacramento on top, leading by a point. And don't go away. After the break, we'll see you right back here for the start of quarter number three. We've got second half action for you, and if the next couple of quarters are similar to the first, this one could go down to the last possession. It's been one outstanding game from Kawhi Leonard. He took a head-on approach in the first half, going straight at the D and drawing fouls. I have to love his tenacity. This guy stays in attack mode, makes defenders work, tries to keep them off balance. Kings leading. And so in the game for the Clippers, we've got Paul George. He's out there with Chris Paul. And it's Leonard in at the three. And that one good. Probably a play they drew up in the locker room at half. Well, there is nothing better than catching a rhythm as early as possible. And boy, that's a terrific start right there. George passes to McAdoo. Just five to shoot. And he gets that one. And clearly he needs no time to warm up. And it's Sacramento's ball. They lead by one. Picked it. Oh, there's the alley. Up high and down it goes on the lob. Here in the second half, this game still nip and tuck. <laughs> Just an insane amount of lead changes. The fans are getting their money's worth. Here's Robertson. Pass to Weber. Here's Richmond. And the foul called on Paul George. That's his first foul. And this is how he shines. He's a big part of their floor space. And right now, Greg, he is doing a great job delivering for this team. Productive and efficient. One shot. Clippers trail by three. 
Paul passes to McAdoo. Back to Paul. Leonard for three. Sacramento grabs the miss. Boy, the offense has been on point. <laughs> they have great timing and great communication. So hard to get stops against them. And so Paul will bring it up for the L.A. Clippers. Rebound by Sacramento. Weber's got a rebound number seven tonight. Two minutes into the second half of play now. Here's Robertson. George defending. Pass to Stoyakovich. And once again, off the mark by Sacramento. He is just so deadly from out there. You expect that to fall. First free throw is good. And that's good as he hits both shots. And here are the Kings now. It's a one-point game. And the foul on Chris Paul. That's his first foul of the game. Not quite two and a half minutes played here in the second half. Pass to Weber. Here's Robertson. Shot clock at six. Here's Richmond. Give him 20. The shot no good. And here's Leonard. Here's McAdoo. Back to Leonard. From the arc. And once again, off the mark by Los Angeles. Here's Stoyakovich. Leonard defending. <laughs> no debate there. He, he got hammered. Sacramento shooting their fifth and sixth free throw attempts tonight. First one falls. Both shots good from the strike. Here's Paul. Nine points in the game. Leonard outside for the tie. It's good. The assist that time from Paul. Paul's got six assists here tonight. Gotta fight harder to get over those screens. You know, we see this all the time. You're basically, as a defender, hoping the man misses rather than putting in the work to get over screens. Here's Weber. 15 points in the game. That one's good by Stoyakovich. Man, this is just fun. These teams are trading threes back and forth. 
Well, that three-point shot just gives you so much room to operate on the offensive end. Time called here. Los Angeles decides to talk it over. We've got some t-shirts. Just over three and a half minutes through the third. Paul passes to George. Leonard up top. 14 feet away. Weber pulls it in. Weber's got his eighth rebound here tonight. Pass to Robertson. Here's Richmond. Give him 20. Leonard with a double team. Weber passes to Richmond. And a foul called on the way up. So he'll take two from the free throw line. It's going to go on Paul George. All right, a look at how the points have been generated so far. A scoring breakdown for Sacramento. Well, the coaching staff has to love what they're seeing on offense. There's so many assists because how this team is moving the ball. I think the other thing we're seeing tonight is the floor spacing of this team. Boy, they are shooting the cover off the basketball all game. That free throw, no good. And he can't hit the second. Uncharacteristic trip to the line for him. Just lost his feel on those shots. Pass to Paul. Oh, deflected. The three. Richmond with the bucket. Richmond's got six points in the quarter. When you get a chance to run the floor like that, you have to capitalize. Great hustle on that play. Paul passes to Leonard. Launches a three. It's good. The assist that time from Paul. It's clear there's a lot of pride on the line in this one. Absolutely. When someone makes a shot, the first thought is, I want my own back. Boy, bodying up there, making sure to get position. That's really nice rebounding technique. McAdoo, the pass to Paul. George outside. Offline with a three. Boy, a wide open shot from his favorite spot. That is one he'd like to have back. Pass to Weber. Here's Richmond. That shot off the mark. Oh, solid D from Leonard. Clippers trail by three. McAdoo, the pass to George. Here's Brand. He hits the back iron and sinks it. Brand's got his third bucket of the night. Pretty dime there. The kind of ball movement coaches love to see. Pass to Richmond. There's the triple. It's rebounded by Los Angeles. Leonard's got his fourth rebound in this one. For the lead. And he drives in. And he takes it up and lays it in. Leonard's got 32 points. Kawhi Leonard, the size, the strength, the ability to put the ball on the floor. I mean, trying to deal with this guy off the drive is so tough. Here's Weber. He's got 15. No good. Had a chance to end the run there. Pass to Leonard. Out to the wing. George outside. Here's the three. Weber pulls it in. Weber's got nine rebounds in the game. Boy, he's getting it done. Richmond, no good from outside. The Clippers in the lead. Leonard passes to Paul. Back to Leonard. Pass to McAdoo. The kick out to Paul. Shot clock at five. Shot by Leonard, no good. Here's Robertson. He's guarded by Paul. The three is up. Sends it home from three-point land. Robertson's got ten points. And it's amazing. Neither team has been able to hold the lead for any length of time. Yeah, these guys are leaving it all 
on the floor tonight. Time called here. Los Angeles decides to talk it over. Pushing it up. Here's Sacramento. And down it goes. Two points. Robertson's got six here in the quarter. Here's Leonard. 32 points in the game for him. To the middle. And he jams it after taking the nice feed on the run. Just such a terrific dunker. Man, born to fly, that's for sure. Pass to Weber. Here's Richmond. And another Sacramento three. Here in the second half, they're really focused on stretching the floor. And guys, boy, when you're hitting, it sure does work. It obviously opens up major options at the offensive end. I just love the aggressive finish. Now, I'm thinking he's sending a strong message with that jam. Here's Robertson. No, no, no. Here's Richmond. He's got 26. Pass to Robertson. Takes a three. Another three for Sacramento. The name of the game isn't scoring. It's scoring efficiency. Outside Paul. Here's free. The rebound by Robertson. The Kings lead by six. Here's Richmond. And he lobs it up. Here's McAdoo. Ten points for him. Down low. Here's Richmond. Pass to Robertson. They set the pick. Here's Lucas. And again, it's Sacramento converting. And it's Paul with the ball for Los Angeles. Trailing by eight. Here's Brand. Give him eight. Pass to Free. Puts up a three. Cut X from downtown. Free's got five points. I'll tell you, you are playing with fire anytime you leave this guy open, and they just got burned. Here's Archibald. He's guarded by Paul. Archibald, the pass to Richmond. Oh, Leonard with the block. Oh, Kawhi Leonard the claw says, not here, not now. And that shot was going nowhere thanks to that aggressive swat. Yeah, I love that they maintain the defensive energy even when they're behind. So both teams making some changes here.
six on the shot clock. Goes up off the inbound. Bibby. Pure from three-point range. Bibby's got the second bucket on the night. I love the efficiency he's playing with tonight. Not scoring as much as usual, but he's been effective and they're winning. Pass to Leonard. 143 left in the third quarter. Manning passes to McAdoo. And Los Angeles, another three. Both teams are starting to find a rhythm here. And this is partly what the game has become, right? A matter of dueling three-point opportunities. First personal foul. Fifth team foul. Shooting two. First one falls for him. That one falls, so he hits both of them. We've got 128 left in the third quarter of the game. Here's Harper. Six points for him. Three-pointer. Can't get it to drop. Sacramento leading by seven. Here's Embry. Pass to Archibald. There's 57 seconds left in the third quarter. And Robertson gets it to go. That's what speed and agility will do for you. Big time play. Here's Free. Uses the glass on the layup. Free's got eight here in this quarter. Well, everyone's seeking those high percentage looks in the restricted area. Nicely done there. Here's Robertson. No good off the glass. Clippers trail by seven. Here's Free. He's got ten. No good there. Just two seconds between the shot clock and the game clock. Bibby, the pass to Archibald. Basket's good. Archibald's got six. That's a finish for the purists out there. The lightest of touches on the finger roll. Here's Harper. Throws it up high. And out of bounds. The Kings will take it. Well, when you're careless with the basketball, you can expect that to happen. And that does it for the third quarter. Both teams clicking offensively as we approach the fourth. The Kings on top, up by nine. Don't go anywhere. The final quarter is coming up next on 2K Sports. Hey, fans. And this is it. Glad to have you along for this fourth quarter. Here's Paul. Pass to Free. Oh, plenty of contact on that shot. Officials call the foul, and he'll take two free throws now. Man, he made sure to get his money's worth on that foul. down the first one.
Hits one, then misses the second attempt from the line. The Kings lead by eight, and so in the game for Los Angeles. They've got DeAndre Jordan, Paul George out there with Chris Paul, and it's Manning in at the power forward position. Third personal foul. First team foul. Take a break. Take a break. Two shots. Oh, yeah, shoot. Big guy. Gotta get it. Big guy, big guy. Big guy. Let's get it. Get it. Get it. Get it. Get it. That one's off. And the second free throw is good. And it's Paul with the ball for Los Angeles. Nine-point game. Pass to free. This one for three. Rebounded by Cousins. Here's Archibald. He's guarded by Paul. Here's Embry. Cashes it in from 11 feet. He really hooked the defender with that pump fake. It worked to perfection. Outside Paul. Pass to George. And he lobs it up to the rim. And it's out of bounds. The Clippers able to retain possession here. You see his active hands knocking that pass out of bounds. Well, that's what you call a game of inches. They talk about it in football. We see it right there. Harper, he's checked in for the Clippers. That's tipped. Clock at six. Jordan, the pass to George. Drops one in from the wing. This guy practically automatic. Paul George in the catch and shoot. Look out. Here's Bibby. He's guarded by Paul. To the inside. Embry. And he dunks it down. I'll tell you, he is so tough to keep down once he gets near that rim. Yeah, he can get up even a few notches higher. Now here's George. And that one goes. He's shooting five of nine in this one. That's a move you won't see many guys make. Impressive stuff. Sacramento leading by nine. They set a pick. Pass to Embry. Here's Richmond. The three is up. He buries it from three. Richmond's got four points this quarter. Pick works well there, but the defense left a lot to be desired. It takes incredible effort to stay connected to the hip of the offensive player. You've got to want to work. Paul, shot is off. Embry passes to Bibby. Here's Stoyakovich. George defending. Here's Embry. It's rebounded by Los Angeles. And if you're just joining us, fourth quarter here. We're just over two and a half minutes into it. And George with the jam. Don't sleep on Paul George's verticality. How nice was that finish? Pass to Embry. Here's Bibby. Takes the three. Can't hit that one. Clippers trail by 10. Outside Paul. To the wing on the left. Here's Manning. Rebounded by Cousins. The Kings lead by 10. A little over three and a half minutes in the books now in this fourth quarter. And the basket by Embry. 
And he couldn't get an easier shot. The defense right now just looks defeated. Well, simply stated, simply not enough effort, not enough attention to detail. They've gotten run over this evening. Here's Manny. From about 16, that shot missing. Great work by the defense. That's the intensity coaches want to see. Here's Richmond. Pass to Bibby. And he's going for the oop here. Oh, and the fast break for the Clippers. Here's Paul. And again, it's the Clippers missing. Paul's gotten three of his eight shots to go. Here's Bibby. He's guarded by Paul. Bibby, the pass to Richmond. Pass to Embry. Oh, a clear foul there on the missed shot. So he'll get a pair at the line. Second team foul. Shooting two. And he makes a first. Both teams will make substitutions. And that one goes in. Two from the line that time. And so it's George with it. He brings it up for Los Angeles. They trail by 14. Inside. Here's McAdoo. Oh! And he goes up strong with a one-handed jam. We know Paul George, a very capable playmaker, guys. He is brilliant as a passer. Here's Stoyakovich. Leonard defending. Here's Robertson. Oh, and he got fouled on his way up. He'll head to the line to shoot two. The officials were right on top of that one. Shooting two. And the first one at the line is good. And good on the second, so he makes them both. Clippers trail by 14. Pass to Brand. And he got the whistle on the way up. So he'll be headed to the line for a pair. one falls that one misses Sacramento leading by 13 Johnson passes to Lucas. Here's Archibald. Pass to Robertson. Just five on the clock. Baseline jumper. It's hauled in by Brand. 
Brand's got his sixth rebound on the night. Here's Harper. Let's it go from 11. Sacramento grabs the miss. Lucas has got 10 rebounds here tonight. So active. Here's Archibald. Pass to Robertson. Let's it go from 14. It's hauled in by Brand. Brand's got seven rebounds in the game. Now here's Leonard. Here's McAdoo. Here's Brand. Let's it go from deep. And the Clippers miss again. Sacramento leading by 13. Archibald, pass to Johnson. And out of bounds, Los Angeles will have it. Unforced turnovers. They'll drive your coach insane. Paul George, he's checked in for Los Angeles. Chris Paul comes in for Harper. So it's Los Angeles now. Leonard on the wing. Pass to Brand. Here's a three from Paul. Sinks it from distance. Absolutely automatic in catch and shoot situations. Go ahead, CP3. We see you. Here's Richmond. George defending. Here's Weber. Here's Stoyakovic. The three ball. The rebound by McAdoo. And you never want to give a shooter like him a clean look. For three, George. It's hauled in by Lucas. Lucas has got rebound number 12 here already in the game. Pass to Robertson. Chris Paul, second personal foul. Fourth team foul. Take a break. Take a break. Two shots. First free throw is good. He's perfect from the line this time. And it's Paul with the ball for Los Angeles. A 12-point game. George feels it out a bit. To the paint. Here's McAdoo. Yes, and it's George picking up the assist. George has got three assists in the game. Well, defensively, to me, you've got to do a better job communicating once the screen comes. Here's Richmond. Here's Weber. Pass to Stoyakovich. And another miss by Sacramento. Clippers trail by 10. Here's Leonard. Ooh, and Leonard throws it down. We are talking about a solid 230 pounds. Kawhi Leonard's strength and his frame allows him to get shots off under duress. Sacramento leading by seven. Pass to Lucas. They swipe it. Here's McAdoo. George outside. And there's another one for the Clippers. 
This team counts on George to deliver points. His consistency under pressure is key to their offense. Here's Richmond. Here's Stoyakovic. Knocks it down from distance. And Sacramento leads by eight. They're going at it on offense. Neither team backing down. I'll tell you, we have seen great execution from both teams. Neither one giving an inch here. Pass to Robertson. Here's Richmond. Oh, nice finish from the low block. That one's good. And now a 10-point Kings lead. And the defense has no one to blame but themselves. I mean, they just let him get right to the rim. To me, this has simply stated been a complete lack of defensive attention and focus all night long. That's what we call a power finish. There's no such thing as gentle for the big man. Here's Richmond. So it'll be two free throws. He was fouled in the act of shooting. the first one and that'll put him up by nine good on both 157 left in the fourth. 16 feet out. It's good. George has got 10 points now, just in this quarter. We call that money from the mid-range. PG doing his thing in the sweet spot. Floats one up. Richmond with the bucket. And Sacramento leads by 10. Boy, that's beautiful touch on the floater. And let's remember, not everyone has that shot in their arsenal. George passes to Leonard. We've got 128 left in the fourth quarter. Kicks it to George. Outside Paul. Shot clock at five. Back to George. From deep. And it's Sacramento with the rebound. They've led by as many as 14. Pass to Lucas. Here's Weber. Here's Stoyakovich. Gets the three to fall. You got to give them respect. They're doing everything they can to close this out. Well, just terrific teamwork. Each guy doing his part. You love what you're seeing from them tonight. Here's Brand. Paul with it. And he floats it in for the easy two. Credit the sweet setup on that one. There's 38 seconds left to play in the fourth. Pass to Lucas. Here's Stoyakovich. And another Sacramento three. Coming down the stretch, they've leaned on the perimeter game. Boy, the three-point arc has been a major factor in what they've done here tonight. You love the aggressiveness. Now here's George. Here's a three from Paul. He can't get it to go. Here's Weber. So no problem for Sacramento as they get the win. A competitive game. You have to feel like this crowd gave him a little extra edge. Yeah, they really fed off the energy. You saw their activity level go up. Just a tremendous performance. And that'll wrap it up, folks. For Grant Hill, Allie LaForce.